Hello everyone, today in this video we are going to walk through the onboarding process of TikTok and Amazon MCF. Initial process starts with the installing of Amazon MCF by WebB from the TikTok Seller Central. Once done, you will land to the register page where you need to enter your work email and the password. Once done, you can click on register to activate your account. The next page would land up to the home or what we call as a dashboard which would prompt you to connect your Amazon Marketplace, which you can easily choose from the drop down and click on connect button. Once done, then it will take you directly to your Amazon Seller Central to add the credentials so that you can authenticate the marketplace that you have chosen from the drop down. The next would be the application settings. Mind the most of the settings which would be related to order the notifications for the errors, the order processing criteria, the shipping categories and the Amazon charges would be linked with this page. To be noted, you can do these settings at the later stage also once you onboard the app completely. You can click on save and get to the next page. The three important things that is order, inventory and tracking is what would be the next page of synchronization between the two integrations. To be noted, to make this process easy and hassle free, we have embedded a setup call button on each page of this on each page of this onboarding process so that you can book a meeting with the customer success team so that they can help you with the onboarding process to make it easy for you. Once done, you can click on next. Voila, you can start your three months trial now. That's how the dashboard looks like. Once you would have all the data, which comes with the order synchronization, weekly, monthly, daily, that would compile an up block with of syncing stats. The below would have the stinking statuses that is order sync, inventory sync and the tracking sync. Then we have the inventory management KPI, the inventory level, the top selling products and the sales order statuses. So this is how the application onboarding processes linked with the different configuration of setting looks like. Thanks for watching.